गाइस दिस इज अभिषेक फ्रॉम गैडिट कॉम एंड टुडे वी हैव द लेनोवो फैबलेट विद अस एंड दिस वन इज कॉल्ड द लेनोवो एस एट सिक्स जीरो दिस इज द लेनोवो एस एट सिक्स जीरो विच हैज बीन अनाउंस ओवर हेयर एट बार्सिलोना एट मोबाइल वर्ल्ड कांग्रेस टू थाउजेंड फोर्टीन एंड वी आर हेयर एट द लेनोवो बोर्ड टू एक्चुअली डू अ हैंड्स ऑन ऑफ दिस डिवाइस दिस डिवाइस विच इज कॉल्ड द लेनोवो एस एट सिक्स जीरो is a pretty decent device in terms of the overall form factor and the build quality the build quality which we have on this device is again actually made up of metal but again the the kind of finishing which lenovo has given to their phones and actually how they actually give it to their phones is very premium and it looks like metal although it is very good quality of plastic which they have actually used when we talk about the specifications of this device when we take a look over the uh, battery first of all the most important thing which is about this device is the battery itself and this is the lenovo p780 upgrade you can say so because this device has a battery of 4000 mAh battery which is going to be pretty huge for the overall backup of your day to day usage so when we talk about this device as far as the display size is concerned this device has 5.3 inch display and the resolution of display is 720 to 1280 it gives you around 277 pixels per inch which is pretty good for a display device of this size when we take a look over the thickness of the device the thickness of the device is around 10 mm again because of the huge battery the device has become little bit wider in terms of the thickness as you can see and again you can easily notice it when you take it take a look from the bottom uh, from the top basically so when we take a look over the hardware specification and the other things let me just give you a hardware overview where uh, the micro sd port for data syncing and charging is over here we have the loud speaker over here on this side we have the power and stick key and the volume rocker and both of these are good quality plastic buttons give you good amount of feedback on the top you have the secondary microphone for noise cancellation you have a 3.5 mm audio jack on this side at the back you have the camera and the camera on this device is so it is an 8 megapixel camera with auto focus and when it comes to the front camera the front camera is a 1.5 megapixel camera pretty good i would say when we talk about the chipset which we have on this device this is running on mediatek 6582 the quad core chipset which is 1.3 gigahertz uh, cortex a7 based architecture cpu which we have on this device and then when we talk about the gpu it has mali 400 as the gpu so again it will give you a pretty good gaming performance as well and another thing which is good about this device is the ram you have 2 gb of ram on this device and 16 gb of internal storage so this is definitely a much better upgrade of the lenovo p780 which we were thinking of and again this device will come to india very soon it will come by the uh, april end or basically may Uh, by in april basically in bit it will come to india so uh, by mid of april or by end of april you will see this device coming to india and it will start selling over there when we talk about the other functionality you do have usb support as well so usb otg support is there on this device as well and also you have on the go charging supported so because it this device has a huge battery so you can actually charge other devices with the help of the battery which we have in this device you can charge other smaller phones as well and when we talk about other things uh, if we take a look over the sensor we have accelerometer sensor sensor gyro sensor you do have assisted gps navigation also supported in terms of the overall look and feel this device is fairly large because it has a 5.3 inch display pretty, pretty big to hold in one hand the one handed usage of the device is definitely limited but again they do have one handed operations and again it has the same kind of ui which we see on the lenovo vibe z again the ui has been enhanced and it is quite snappy there is no lag of any kind which we can notice in the ui at least so let me just go to the system settings and show you first of all the version of android which is there on this device so once we go to the system settings and about version of android uh, we can show you the version of android and here it is okay it is not here let me just go back uh, okay version information so over here you have the version of android which is android 4.2.2 and it is not kitkat and again this is a quite disappointment but pretty okay uh, for a device of this size and again this device won't be very costly in terms of the price it should be in between 15 to 20000 rupees when it comes to indian market let me just show you the storage scenario and other things you do have gps navigation supported when it comes to the storage this device has 16 gb of internal storage out of which around 4.52 gb is available and as of now 11.9 gb approximately 12 gb you will get on this device as far as the storage is concerned when we take a look over the display scenario the display does have support for automatic brightness as well and led notification light is also there on this device so you can customize the led notification light whenever you want to when we take a look over the other settings let me just check out the ram scenario so once we take a look over the running application which are there running in the background as of now out of 2 gb of ram around 854 844 mb of 43 mb of ram is being used and you have around 1.1 gb of ram which is free 
so the good amount of free ram is actually available and the device is snappy as well you do have location services supported you have support for gps uh, for creating a portable wi-fi hotspot as well and it works pretty well and we have just tested the same so in all this device looks pretty good the kind of specification it has is definitely making this device going uh, if, if it is launched at the right price point it can actually rock in this particular price segment of 15 to 20 thousand rupees because you get a very good battery good amount of features and the display is also pretty good it is an ips lcd display so the viewing angles of the display are pretty good you can see this display from extreme angles without any issue so display is not going to be a problem for this device that is something which we can notice and this device should come to India as soon as possible because this is a pretty decent device and definitely very much uh, useful in the scenarios which we have in India especially uh, the scenarios where you have the battery ran out and then you have to actually search for the power, power port on this device you have a pretty huge battery and this can be a very good successor for the Lenovo P780 and it should come to India very soon when we take a look at the phone dialer this is how the phone dialer looks like the phone dialer does not offer you the option of making a video call directly when we take a look at the messaging application messaging application is again stock and not stock android but custom and you do have continuous input supported on this device it also gives you the suggestion as well so typing should not be a problem on this device the browser is also pretty good again we won't be able to show you the browser performance when we talk about the applications these are all the applications which we have on this device there is no app door on this device as far as the ui is concerned so you cannot actually access all the apps they will be actually shown over here on the home screen itself so these are all the application which you will get so in all this device looks like a decent device let me just give you an overview of the camera as well now so the device when it comes to the camera has an 8 megapixel camera at the back and this is how the camera ui looks like it can record high definition video at 720p as well as at 1080p and let me just take a photo of my iphone 5 so that you can get an idea about the overall quality of the device when it comes to the camera so we have the device over here and let me just take a photo okay so we have just taken a photo and let's see how does this photo actually look like and again if you compare it to the actual object this photo is much brighter and much clearer as well in terms of the details so both the colors as well as the amount of details which i see in this photo is really good so the camera is performing pretty good especially the rear camera and let me just show you the view from the front camera as well and this is how the view will look like from the front camera the front camera is pretty good it can do a good quality video chat and again it seems to be that it can do a high definition video chat from the front camera which is definitely a good thing so in all this device is pretty decent pretty good in terms of the overall hardware specification it has it should be launched at the right price point the kind of build quality you have on this device the kind of form factor you have the for this device is going to be good it is going to be a next tablet which you can actually afford to have and again it will give you great battery backup and great entertainment experience and one thing which i really like about this device is the overall build and the look and feel the build is solid so it is quite solid and again the look and feel of the device is such that you actually are having a metal phone so it looks like a metal phone from the back side so that's all from us as far as the quick hands-on of this device when it comes to the final thing about this device which i would like to say the weight of this device is slightly higher so it actually feels heavier because of the huge battery which we have on this device and again that is why the device is little bit heavy but you can easily hold this device in one hand and again you can carry it around with you as well it might feel heavy in the few initial days but once you start using it you will get used to it that's all from us do let us know if you have any specific question for this device we would love to help you you can like this video if this video helped you by clicking the like button below you can subscribe to our youtube video channel for more videos like this by clicking the subscribe button below thanks for watching this video this is abhishek signing off thank you